We're here with Paula to find out more about the program and exactly um, what's happening and how it's rolling out. Okay. Paula? I'm a teacher at Parkview, a secondary school, and three years ago I was asked to start a program for disengaged children. And so I started a program in the tech room where we started uh, focusing on recycling objects and dumpster diving and donations from people in the community and we started making a lot of the stuff that you see all around here. Um, the kids quickly started selling all of their stuff and so we decided to start building it and then earlier this year Paul Beattie, our principal, was at a meeting with the Sherman Hub that is a community center that is all to do with the community and building this community up and he introduced me to Paul Brown, who is here somewhere. That's the owner of the store, Paul right. Brown, yep. who saw a lot of our the kids' um, items in the hallway in the front entrance and said, like, I'd like to see who's doing this. So we were introduced, and from that, this developed. He has given us his storefront to display and sell all of our stuff. Awesome. So it's a highly incentive program because the kids get a portion of the money. The, the people do get a portion of the money, or the kids do get a portion of the money, and then they are learning and through it, they are getting four or five credits throughout this, uh, uh, three of them being tech, art, business, co-op, and there's different ones that we do, and it depends on what they need for math and, and, and different credits that they would need. So when this is all done, we will be doing all the business end of it to talk about the overhead and every, what everything costs, but the big incentive is especially for the kids of this neighborhood is being paid. And the creativity, they are 100% they are responsible for their creations. They develop them, they look at what's around the classroom, they look on the net, they decide, I really want to do that, and then they focus on it, and between uh, me and the other teachers and our EA, that was Katie that just yelled at us, yeah. um, that is what happens here with all these creations. This is awesome. This is it so is awesome. awesome. Now, you've, you've taken this model, and you're um, you're putting it, this is from, from the school, right here. Right here. So this right now, as far as I, I know, is the first ever store like this in Ontario. One more time, one more time for the camera. This is the first ever store like this in Ontario, maybe Canada. Outstanding. And, I'll say Canada. Uh, and I'll say Canada too. And I'll, I'll tell you why I know that. Because I teach an alternate education, additional qualification for teachers. Right. And I'm the only person in Canada that teaches that. And I get teachers from across Canada, so I know what programs are doing. I know what incentive programs are doing in Ontario, but I even know outside of the province. And no one has done this. So we are the first, and uh, it is outstanding what the kids have done. Great leadership. Thank you so much. Thank you. Very, very good. God bless you.